Stylesville. Oh god. Wake up, sleepyhead. We're gonna be so late for the interview. There's voice acting as this kid. What? Oh sweet, this is the game based of Addy. What? Huh? Did you just sleep with jeans on? That is so uncomfortable, lady. Fashion designer Marco Beretti is in town to debut his hot new fashion line. We have an interview with him, remember? Could you round up the girls and make sure they're ready? Try stretching your legs a little first. Stretching your legs? They're stretched. I don't think I can stretch them anymore. <laughs> slamming. Now, <laughs> see how the phone. That is the most slamming streamer. I'm slamming, bro. <laughs> oh, but you look scorching already. Scorching? This sounds like something Beebs would say. I'm so sorry. If Beebs is still here, I'm so sorry for saying that, but this is kind of how you talk. You just add weird words into things as compliments, and I don't get it. <laughs> bro, what the fuck? Every time, Beebs just add like a weird word into things that all of the mods are just like, wait, what the fuck? You all suck. You love me, and you know that. You all know we love you, Beebs. We're doing this in a friendly way, just like how you bully me for being shorter than you, even though you're younger. <laughs> Can you help me find it? I think I left it in the hall. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. She's like... Okay, first off, you gotta select the kind of makeup you want. Why don't you try the blue lipstick? No! It's so much blue already! This is ridiculous! Why? This is the definition of I'm blue, da ba dee da ba die. And if I was green, I would die. Uh, I can skip. It's tempting. Meet the brats. Casual jackets. Okay. Did I also get a blue lipstick for chance? Thanks for the pep talk, guys. Mwah. <laughs> Mwah. Mwah. The interview? Ah, ah yes. A about my new clothing line, see? That's right. You ready? Not at all. It's a disaster. My little Paula has disappeared. Oh my gosh! Your daughter's gone missing? My daughter? No, no, my, my, my puppy. My beautiful, darling puppy. She ran off while mm. I was distracted by a, a simply perfect pair of jeans. You got distracted by jeans? You know what? You deserve to lose your puppy. Don't worry, Mr. Beretti. No one knows Stylesville like we do. We'll help you find her. Oh, grazie, girls. Thank you. They even show me where it is. They're, they're like, you know what? You, you're just gonna get lost. This is where the dog is. Go over there. No fun allowed. This season's hottest accessory. Oh, God. Chunky chain necklaces, of course. What? Huh? No! Necklace, give me my chains. Am I trendy now? Did I do it right? Anyone want to be a dog? What? <laughs> is it going to be a YouTube video? Hi, mom. Yes, it is. If you're watching on YouTube, subscribe. Also, come join us. We do mad shit on Twitch. <laughs> oh, hey, Yaz. I guess I'm kind of nervous. Today's the grand opening of my new beauty salon, and I'm majorly freaked. What if no one comes? This place is scorching. No Ugh. way it's going to fail. Scorching. I could use some help getting the word out about the salon. I'm thinking we go old school. How about we take some pictures of the place? I bet that would get some cool customers in the door. This is amazing. Look how many people showed up. Nailed it. I did it. Let's try it. All right. I'm scared. I'm fast as fuck, boy. I can't see what's happening. Oh my god. My eyes. My eyes. Uh. Hey, smoothie special? Wait, Eaton? You're the smoothie maestro that's got the town talking? If you've come to try my sunshine in a glass smoothie, you're out of luck. I'm missing a bunch of ingredients. How about we collect the missing ingredients so we can make it? I need three oranges. The ones that grow in Stylesville Park. We actually have something else to do now. Wow, the graphics are beautiful. 
Better trees than some Nintendo kids. What are we looking for? Dopes. This is what I was waiting for any game of the year. I know, right? This is the best game ever. It's my favorite. I fucking love it. I'm having so much fun. I would I'm literally never gonna play Genshin ever again because this is so much better. Yeah, you heard me. I'm totally not being sarcastic. What are you talking about? I'm also running some rad yoga sessions in the park. You girls should join in! Yoga's pretty chill normally, but today we're spicing things up with a little competition. <laughs> what is that voice? I did it. I totally spaced. Yoga always gets me way relaxed. <gasps> did we win? So, how? You're looking at I the won. new yoga champs of Stylesville Park. Looks like you earned yourselves a prize. If you ever want free yoga sessions, I'm your gal. Just drop by the park and talk to me. They always pose like this. If you want to take a selfie, you, you got to do this with your leg up. If you guys meet me IRL ever, I'm expecting you all to do that pose as a joke. Excuse me, girls, but are you the Bratz Pack? I'm a designer looking to capture the beauty of nature in my work. So you must be here at the park to get some inspiration then. The park is home to the most majestic of creatures, the squirrel. Say, do you think you could take some pictures and help us capture the beauty of these adorable little things? You got it. Hey, can I take a picture of you? It's dabbing! <laughs> Why? Oh my god! That one's better. Oh my god, we got another dabber. Jesus, tap dancing Christ! Hey, Professor! We got those squirrel pics you asked for. They were dabbing. I swear those little guys just knew how to rock a pose. Wow, you girls have a real eye for wildlife photography. These creatures of the forest, well, park, are a perfect example of what makes nature so beautiful. Is this the content you guys subscribe for? Is this the content you followed for? Asking for a friend. Let's make this interesting. My mysterious ingredient just got flown in at the airport this morning. How about you go pick it up for me? And if you can figure out what it is without peeking inside the box, you ladies get free smoothies for a week. Woo! Yeah, baby! That's what I've been waiting for. Imagine it. Seven whole days of free foodie fabulousness. Oh, you're on, Eaton. I see a chest. I see a chest. Chest! I'm running in the airport. No one's stopping. I'm, I'm running on wet floor. No one's stopping me. Ah. Hey, Megan. You look like a girl on a mission. You headed somewhere grooving? Grooving? Oh, hey. How'd you guess? This chick's flying to LA. I got tickets to an Alonce concert. Even the tickets look cool. Check them out. Oh, no. No, no, no. This can't be happening. My ticket, it's gone. I know I had it when I was at the smoothie bar in the mall. I'll check once we go back there. You're the one who lost it. I know, right? We're just like helping people. I didn't sign up for this. I only signed up to make people laugh. Bratz is huge. It was huge in the 2000s. I had a few. And I remember Jade was being, was my favorite because I was a tomboy. And she, she's tomboy. She likes like motorcycles and who the fuck is messaging me? She wore like baggy pants and yeah, she's cool cat. So that was my favorite. Ticket? Here? I don't think so. Why don't you ask the last person who sat at the same table as Megan? Their name, but they were wearing a red hat and purple shirt. Isn't he just sitting right here? Bitch, are you blind? <laughs> A ticket? I haven't seen one, but I think I heard someone talking about it. What's that voice? Wait, this is Megan's? She and I get way back. Why do you sound like a chipmunk? <laughs> you better get this back to her. I bet she's freaking. They should have added Paimon's voice actor. Paimon! 
Paimon doesn't want to be in this game because Paimon is annoying on its own and doesn't need competition to be more annoying because Paimon should be the only one that's annoying. You found my ticket? I can't believe it. Yeah, you're welcome. Perfect. Hey, we're here to pick up a package for Eaton. Apparently, it's got his top secret smoothie ingredient inside. Here you go. Egan challenged us to work out what his secret smoothie ingredient is without picking inside the box. Could you give us a clue what's in there? Hmm. Let's just say there's a good reason people are going nuts for his new recipe. It's nuts, isn't it? Going nuts, huh? Thanks for the tip. I guess we'll cash you later. <laughs> Hello. Is it true that your secret ingredient is nuts? We're guessing you use cashews or almonds or something. Uh, I knew you girls couldn't resist a good mystery. You got me. I make my smoothies super creamy with cashew milk. Delicious and vegan. Super creamy nuts. Perfect. We're in the theater. I blinked again. Ha, Hi, Glam Gecko. Glam oh. Gecko? What? Hey, I'm working on my fashion world tour photo project. I'm here at the theater to photograph streetwear outfits. The dancers here got me mad inspired. We have the same top. That's actually a crime in fashion world, isn't it? Want to do some modeling with me? Oh, no, not this again. Come back in streetwear clothes and blue makeup and the same style as mine. Ugh. Why blue? Blue lipstick is not good. It's it's yucky. It's not blue, right? I will change once we get home, but I need to go to the clothing store first. Why is there no mini map for stupid people like me who get lost for no reason? Wait, what's happening? Cutscene? There's more content? Hey, what's up? Hey, Dylan. Hey, Eden. And who's this little cutie? This is Missy, my neighbor's cat. I'm taking care of her while she's on vacation. She's been acting off all day and I don't know why. I thought maybe you guys could help. You better believe it. Brats, we got work to do. We're helping a cat now? There's only one street where it pans and it's these? Oh, rip. Okay, we do need those. Upper eyeshadow. No, lighter blue. This is more of a blue blue. Yeah, this looks horrible. We're good to go. Because <laughs> you haven't fed it. It's probably something that stupid. It even wants it either wants toys, it needs water, or it needs to be fed. Oh, I know. Cats can be pretty fussy eaters. If Dylan's feeding Missy something different than what she's used to, maybe that's got her feeling not so stylin'. Cats can be total party animals. Literally! They like socializing as much as I do. Can't relate, Sasha. Ooh. This game has got a great story in deep lore. I know, right? So, did you figure out what's wrong with Missy? Let Hungry. me ask a few questions first. Some cat food my neighbor left? Mm. Only all the time. I love cats. Same, Dylan. Same. Now that you mention it, my neighbor did say something about a cat Missy hangs with. Of course! She's feeling lonely. I'll go take her to meet her friend right now. I'm sure that'll get Missy feline fine in a flash. I helped the cat. Man, I am feeling this ensemble. Let's get it snapping. I don't, I'm not feeling it. Why do I always blink? You know what? No. Suffer. Suffer me. Thanks for the model and magic. See you around. Oh, I really need to change my, oh. Do I change my outfit before I finish this game? I don't think this is the end of the game. Really? Yeah, this is as pretty as I can go. Oh no. This is the worst luck since we put on the Scottish play. Hey, Brett's back here, back and ready to cover the talent show. Uh, are you okay? If things don't start looking up soon, there won't be a show to cover. Oh no, what's the stitch? What's the stitch? Are you Kim Possible now? What the frick? It's 10 minutes till curtain up and we're nowhere near finished with all the preparations. What do you say, ladies? Sounds like a mission for our fierce fashion foursome. Foursome? 
We need to hang some posters around the entrance, take pictures of the contestants for social media, and give the marquee a brand new look for opening night. Did you laugh because of foursome? Maybe. Shooting spot. You know what I hate? I do this pose. This game was made for you. No, don't say that. You gotta do this pose at Addicon 2023. Oh god. Okay, now what? Huh? You're back! And just in time for the opening number. Who says you gotta be late to be fashionable? Pretty and punctual. Mm -mm. I don't know how you did it, but it looks like the show's ready to start. Brava, girls, brava. A few moments later. Oh, it's a disaster, a catastrophe. Wait, what? Oh no, not this again. What's wrong now? It's curtains for the entire production. The talent show is canceled. What? The dance crew that was supposed to appear at nine can't make it. Dang, that bites. Can't you just go on without them? Our tickets promised four performances minimum. Alas, the people. drama, the disappointment. Okay, crazy idea. How about we do it? That's excellent news. Speak to Fiona backstage when you're ready to start. So, you're the new dance crew, huh? Yeah, hello. Whenever you're ready, step through the stage door. Follow the rhythm. Oh, shit. That was one scorching performance. What is this scorching? Elegant, edgy, exciting. Brett, there's no doubt in my mind. You've won the talent show. Woo! The prize is yours. Wait, did you just say prize? What's the prize? There's a prize? First prize is tickets to the Extreme Games in Barcelona for the whole team. Oh. The Extreme Games? That'd be the perfect place to get sporty scoops for the magazine. So we get a new area. Plus, hola, sunshine. J time. Barcelona. New York. So there is a new area after this. Welcome to the Extreme Games. This year is going to be our best yet. Extreme sports, extreme drama, extreme coolness. Testing the world's greatest athletes to the extreme. Extreme! You're reporters, right? I've got a surprise event for you that you'll... The extreme games are all about excellence. The best of the best. Any magazine who wants full access has got to reach 100,000 subscribers. What? Oh, we have a new apartment, though. Ooh, this one's prettier. Can you believe we made it to Barcelona? Ah! Total plot twist! Rats Mac is moving on up. Right. Extreme game surely got us an extreme apartment. Speaking of extreme, I want to get an extreme tan as well. Let's hit the beach for a little R and R. R and R? Beach. What's that? Oh, fashion emergency. I totally forgot to pack a swimsuit. Oh no. Well, we could go get a new one. I mean, Bunny Boo can't kick it beachside in her town clothes, right? Oh, yes. As if we need an excuse to go shopping. Girls, it's mall time. Okay, real talk, Dylan. Is Eden avoiding me? He's totally giving me the cold shoulder. Uh-oh, boyfriend drama. I don't know, but it's not just you. He's been hiding from everyone on the balcony, like, all day. Weird. Come on, let's check it out. <gasps> Ooh, sunburn! Oh no! Uh, don't come out here. I look ridiculous. Oof. Oh my gosh, Eaton! How sunburned are you? That's what I'm wondering too. They only got four tickets, but yet the boys are here. I hit the beach earlier and kind of forgot to wear sunscreen. Dude, you look like a tomato. Dylan! Jeez, we have to be able to do something to help. 
Girls, we've got to help Eaton out. He looks redder than our Rock Angels cruiser. Ideas, anyone? I thought I packed some aloe gel, but I don't know where I left it. Look in the wardrobe? Definitely. Nope, not here. Oh my god, did you guys see that? The FPS couldn't uh, deal with it. Zilch! Look in the desk. Found it! On my way, Eaton! Hey, got you a little something for your sunburn. Man, thanks. Yoink! <laughs> That's not how sunburns work. <sighs> You know, that does feel a lot better. That's... that's not... That's, that's not how it works! Please don't do that again. Sunburn is no joke. But now that we've all seen you, you might as well stop hiding. We're not gonna judge, silly. But... I look like a lobster. A cute lobster. How do you know, Addy? You don't go out in the sun. Ooh. Okay, rude. Yeah, but a cute one. Scorching style <laughs> isn't about looking perfect. It's about self-confidence. Here, let's take a photo. Who cares if you're a little red? So, you got the drip, I know, right? You here for the roller skating race? It's one of the extreme games fringe events happening all over the city. If this is the first time you're doing the Barcelona track, you'd better get familiar with the circuit first. Nah, we'll, we'll you gotta just know do the stuff. bends like a pro, right? Nah, we'll here are the different stuff. locations you should know about. No. If you could take a picture and bring them back so I can no. check them out. I don't get what I'm doing. I'm so lost. The goal is to survive the game. True. I don't know where this first turn is. Hey! Ready for the what? Ready for water? the what now? There's a water fight going down? Of course! It's one of the Extreme Games Fringe events. Count us in! You're looking at Styles High's resident queens of H2O. You should ask around. Maybe one of the other contestants has a spare water gun you can borrow. Can you? Do you have any extra water guns? I just lent my last one to someone else. Sorry. And he Could our it. team borrow a water gun? <laughs> of course. Here you go. I see you found a water gun. Looks like you're in for a shot after all. Then let the extreme water fight begin. begin. Oh no. This again. One eternity later. I did it. Whoa! That was one insane water fight. Talk about staying hydrated. Angel, your aim was off the hook. We should totally take a selfie. The wet hair look is in after all. Oh god. I'm covering Sasha now! No, that's fine. Okay, so you. Hey, do you sell swimsuits here? Customers, finally. No one's been in all day. Oh no, I can see where this is going. Wait, no one's been in but us? Well, that can't be right. These clothes are totally slamming. I don't know. I guess maybe my designs aren't for everyone. No way. Like Angel said, this place is a fashion treasure trove. Maybe the store just needs a little promo. You really think so? Hmm. I know. I should go spread the word around the beach. That would get some customers. But I can't leave the store right now. Maybe you ladies could help me out. I'll throw in that swimsuit you were looking for. What do you say? Wanna spread a little passion for fashion? Oh god. Duh! That was meant to be French? I have no clue what that was meant to be. That accent was weird. Beach. Supposed to talk to him, I guess? Loving your look. Straight away from the store, check you down. All right. Hello, Felicia? Why are no you doing here? No way! Felicia! You're in Barcelona too! <laughs> Wait, what? Sure am! I'm working on my fashion world tour photo project. I'm here in Barcelona to photograph the scorching beach babe look. Wanna do some modeling with me? Come back in beach clothes and orange makeup and the same style as mine. Oh god, not this again. Girls, I don't know what to say. 
This place is buzzing. Thank you so much. Hey, don't give us all the credit. Your hot designs did all the heavy lifting. <sighs> Thanks. One swimsuit coming right up. Here you go. Hope you like it. Beach top. That's not a swimsuit. I'm very lost. I don't know where the first turn is. I found it. Don't worry about it. Maybe. Maybe this is. I don't know. Take a picture off the bridge. I'll jump off the bridge. What? Win the race. All right. Oh my god, the FPS! No! <laughs> my eyes! Ah! Whoa! How'd you get so fast? I'm Sonic! Once you got running and hills down, skates are easy. True! Come on, how about we take a picture? Go for it. Oh my god, look at look at his smug pose orange like a lot of orange i think we already reached the yeah we did i don't technically have to do this like picture thing what's that it's yuck oh talk about delivering on the beach babe look i love it let's get a photo it worked whoa that shot's a keeper thanks Felicia? Felicia, hey! Looking sizzling as always. You know it! I'm working on my fashion world tour photo project. I'm here at the Extreme Games to photograph some style and sportswear. Wanna do some modeling with me? Come back in sporty clothes and green makeup and this- Green makeup? Yuck! This one matches better. Kinda hate it though. Thanks for the fabulosity! Later! Hey, we got those 100,000 subscribers you asked for. Nice work. Guess that means you're ready for your first Extreme Game scoop. Today, competitors go head to head in several contests. Hi. How about you start by interviewing the Wings, Blaze, and Tiburon teams? They're the big thing in extreme sports right now. Coolness. We should snap some photos, too. Their faces look like nightmare material, not gonna lie. Yep. Sasha here, reporting for Bratz Magazine. Mind if we get an interview? Sure. Hit me. Oh. It is not her color. What drew you to extreme sports? The adrenaline. 100%. I'm all about the thrill. The thrill. What's the most important skill for an athlete? I gotta say, teamwork. Team Wings is one big crazy family. Hi, styling sports reporter Chloe here. She looks like a bitch. Got a sec for an interview? Sure, whatever. What made you want to compete in the extreme games? Winning! This is a loser-free zone. Being a pro athlete can be tough. What does it take to be the best? To catch them all. Simple. Be a part of Team Blaze. The rest are just posers. Posers. Hey, got time for an interview? I gotta get the Tiburon hot take. Sure. What made you want to try extreme sports? A close friend of mine introduced me to it. I gave it one try, and I was hooked. Do you think it's okay to try and take any shortcuts in a competition to get ahead? Never. Cheating's the worst. Totally not cool. And... that's it. Thanks. Up next, photos. Game Awards? Hey, three rockin' interviews. Done and dusted. Great work. Don't forget to come back here once you publish them. We've still got loads of cool events coming up. Uh, are you okay? I think someone's been messing with my skateboard. My wheels came loose during my last run, and I almost crashed into the audience. Cheating! You cool? How many fingers am I holding up? I'm fine. My board's seriously dinged up, though. I can't believe it. Someone tried to sabotage me just to take me out of the competition. Don't worry. No way we're letting some sneaky saboteur ruin the contest. We'll figure out who did this. Almost hey, quashed. if it helps, I was hanging out in the stands earlier, and I wasn't paying much attention to my board. Ooh, maybe that's when the saboteur saw their opportunity to take it and booby-trap the wheels? That's in the stands. Where's the stamp? I don't know. I don't know where anything is. You know what's on my brain? My brain is what to have for dinner. Excuse me, did you see someone take a skateboard from around here? Now that you mention it, I 
did see a guy take a skateboard to the press area and come back later to drop it off. He seemed kind of shifty, if you ask me. Oh? I think he was wearing some Team Blaze gear. Team Blaze? Huh? Thanks. Ladies, let's hit the press area. This mystery ain't over yet. Team Blaze? Kinda sus, ain't it? Oh. Hey, look! A cell phone! This has got to belong to the culprit. They must have dropped it when they were tinkering with the wheels. Wow, Yaz. Have you been writing a mystery story lately? Because your detective skills are mad impressive. Uh, guys, the phone just got a text. Oh. Let me see. <gasps> Looks like they're headed to the airport. This is our chance. If we head to the airport now, I'm sure we'll find our saboteur there. Mm. Hmm. Where'd I put my cell phone? It's not in my pocket. Hey, is this your phone? Uh, yeah. Where did you find it? Oh, nowhere. Just at the Extreme Games venue, where you sabotaged a competitor's skateboard. How could you know that? I thought no one saw me. An attendee saw the skateboard from the stands and pieced together. You're so busted. I'm sorry I didn't mean to hurt anyone, really. My teammates and I just thought that if we could put this off this game, two players would have a better chance of winning. Uh, understand. Sorry to be the bringers of seriously lame news, but turns out Team Blaze tried to sabotage the competition. They admitted everything. Dun dun dun. What? Then I guess I have no other choice. Team Blaze must be disqualified from the Extreme Games. Although that does leave us one team short. Yes. Unless. Me. What if you guys join the competition? You definitely got the teamwork part down. You mean us? Like us us? That would be awesome! Perfect! You should chat with the track organizer. They'll help you find all the gear you'll need. Oh my god. Now I could have seen this twist. No one. Hey, you're the new contestants, right? Team Bratz? Team Bratz? <laughs> you should head to the prep area to get your competition gear. Come talk to me whenever you're ready. You bet. Oh, okay, I got the gear. Oh. Oh, okay. Introducing Team Bratz. Scorching, styling, and ready to slay. Nice. Head out onto the track and show us what you got. I gotta take a picture? What? I did it. Fish where with who? Where do I take a picture? Knock yourselves out. Oh, there we go. They break the game. I didn't. No, no, no. We good. We good. We good. We good. Soak it in, girlfriends. We won. Let's go. I know, right? Everybody, huddle up. This would make the greatest shot for the magazine. Imagine being in sound booth for hours recording these lines. Yep. Give me a sec. My phone's blowing up. Uh, guys, I think Mr. Beretti's calling me. You know, the Beretti. No way! Quick, put him on speaker. What? Ciao, girls. Can you hear me? Loud and clear, mio amico. I'm calling with an idea. Since the first time I met you all, I could see into your hearts. And there I saw fashion. Did you see passion for fashion? I'm organizing a fashion show in Seoul with designers from all over the world. We get to go to Seoul. And I want you to participate with your own designs. Wait up. Us and Seoul? With our own designs? That's right. What do you say? That's Bunny Boo for we totally love to. Whoa. This is Major! Yes. Looks like we're headed to Seoul. Maybe I can find my soul there. <laughs> Why don't you head over to the airport and hop on the first flight over? Thanks, Mr. Beretti. We won't let you down. See you in Seoul. Is this real? I want to fly to Seoul. Sasha time. Where's Seoul? Oh, I like their outfits now. These look cool. These outfits are cool. Ah, you made it. Welcome to Seoul. Thank you. 
Mr. Beretti, hey! Uh, no time for chit-chat, I'm afraid. Uh, catwalk preparations are calling. But here, take the keys to your apartment. Once you're settled, come find me at the Art Expo. We have much to discuss before the fashion show. You got it, Mr. Beretti. See you there. Oh, and one more thing. Our event sponsors are very demanding. For the event to be a success, all the designers have to be oh so popular. It would be great if your magazine could get, shall we say, 200,000 subscribers by then? 200,000? Those are some serious that. numbers. <laughs> Knowing you girls, I'm sure you'll manage. Got to run. Ciao. Yeah, we're already very close to it. This is easy. Ooh, look at this. This is fancy. This place is awesome. Why do we bring the boys with us? Please, awesome doesn't even cover it. It's amazing. Man, I can't wait to check out the street fashion here or just feel the vibes of the city. Yeah, yeah, but first. Let's unpack. What? No, are you crazy? What? Let's go shopping. Oh my God. Angel, yes. I'm gonna chill here. It was a long flight. Suit yourself. Let's hit it, girlfriends. Shopping. Go to the mall, no. Shouldn't you unpack? Yeah, that's the first thing I'd do. Also, yeah, I agree. Why is it so brutally pink? Also, there's only like four beds. Where do the boys sleep? I have questions, concerns, and everything above. Only fun sleep in that apartment. Paparazzi? Ask what's going on. Excuse me? Can you tell us what's going on here? What's the crowd for? Out of my way. <sighs> Uncalled for much? We just wanted to know what's going on. If you must know, we got a tip that a famous actor is in there. Really? Who? I don't know. Who cares? <laughs> what matters is, he's famous. And we're gonna get a surprise snap of him as soon as he comes out. Wait, don't you think someone should give him the heads up that there's a whole fleet of photographers outside? Is it Ryan Reynolds? Nicholas, you would be the first to be there if it was Ryan Reynolds. I doubt it is Ryan Reynolds. Um, no. Guys, we gotta get in there and warn him that- <laughs> Yeah, that's not happening. But- Shh, I can't get distracted. Jesus, people are ruthless. Jeez, that guy was so rude. I don't like it. They've got this whole paparazzi ambush plan, and they don't even know who the actor is. Wait a minute. That's it. They don't know who the actor is. Well, yeah, that's what Mr. Rude said. Mr. Rude. I have an idea. Let's go find Dylan. Quick, quick. Oh, no. No, not this again. Oh, Jesus. Oh my god, I hate this. Oh god. Time for your eyes to burn! You should play Barbie games next? I did it. Stop. Hey, Deal Man fans! Dylan here, ready to rock the world with his killer dance moves. Dance break. Uh, uh, uh. Flip. Yeah. Interesting. I just cringe and lost the 100 years of my life. It's your fault, Daddy. No, it's Codus' fault. And the crowd goes wild. Woohoo! All right. You did not just see that. We did. <laughs> Something's up at the fashion store. Could you help us out? Ooh, we kinda need someone to pretend to be a famous actor to distract the paparazzi. And you're perfect for the job. They're gonna know I'm not him. Don't worry about that. I have just the thing. Huh? <laughs> Rip. OMG! It's Tom Denmark! Denmark? What? Huh. Okay. Who? Tom Denmark? The famous actor? They're saying he's gonna bust into the music scene big time this year. We should warn him about the paparazzi crew outside. Shades or no shades, Dylan won't be able to keep them distracted forever. I excuse me, Mr. Tom Denmark? Yes? 
thought you should know there's a bunch of paparazzi in the street. They're following our friend around right now, but they're bound to be back. Thanks for the heads up. You guys here for some retail therapy? Retail therapy? Us? Oh, oh yeah, I, we're shopping for, um, uh, clothes? Sorry, I run a music column for our magazine, and I guess I'm a little starstruck. We'll leave you alone now. A magazine, huh? You know, you girls have great style. If you want to ask anything for your magazine, I'd be happy to give an interview. So, how did your career start? <laughs> I got discovered by my agent in acting school. And finally, is it true that you plan on starting a music career? You heard about that. Well, yeah, it's true. I'm dropping my debut album next month. Thanks for chatting to Bratz Mag. Is it okay if we take a picture? Sure, no problem. These selfies are horrible. Oh, cutscene. Ooh, what's happening to her hair? Wait, 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 are you seeing in the background? She has a beard now. I'll match you, don't worry. If my newest creation you wish to pursue, look for clues in the places you go through. Okay, I have no idea what that means. Are we sure this isn't another prank? It's no prank. I recognize that symbol. It's the symbol of the secret designer. Oh my gosh, the secret designer! Wait, what's a secret designer? The secret designer. He's only like Cool Cat's hero. She even wrote a paper on him once, remember? Awesome! And it sounds like he's inviting us to look for his newest design. The first clue says find the place where people drink coffee. The coffee shop? Ooh, is it this? The second clue says find the place where the moon rests on the ground. Where the moon rests on the ground? So there's like a moon exhibit somewhere? That's... Hmm, that's not the moon. I was about to say, this looks like planets, and then I realized it's just balls. <laughs> ah, we meet again. How is Sol treating you? Great. Like VIPs, this place is styling. Excellent. Now, to business. You're going to design outfits for my fashion show, see? Mm-hmm. Of course. Perfecto. Then I have a suggestion. Look around, talk to the artists. Let the local art inspire your work. Explore the expo. Feast your eyes on the fashion. I'm gonna look at balls, okay. I'm no ex- Hi! Can you tell us about your piece? Certainly. I call this Stack of Spheres. What the fuck is that voice? What's it about? About? Spheres. Stacked. Okay. But what does it mean? Whatever you see in it. That's the beauty of art. It can mean something different to everyone. It's not important what I think. What does this piece say to you? Hey, got a sec? Sure. Could you talk to us about your art? Of course. I'm sensing a lot of spacey vibes with this piece. The moon, the planets. Does it have special meaning for you? This installation's my love letter to the stars. Oh, this is my love letter to the stars. You see, I'm just so deep like that. I see the star says, you know, my love and everything I care about. And I just need to send love letters so I built a moon that's on the ground for them. And yeah. It oh depicts the night sky. <laughs> All that empty space it reminds us how very small we are in this big big universe i feel like a teeny tiny stud on jade's fave black faux leather boots thanks for the perspective should be here somewhere oh there it is i love nature but not next to oh it's airport oh okay well i'm not doing that yet hey i'm sasha nice to meet you what can you tell us about your art? I'm guessing you're not afraid of bright colors? No way. Color is my whole vibe. Bright, bold, in your face stuff. That's a hundred percent me. You like stuff in your face? Good for you. Etsy, <laughs> what? <laughs> I love it! Of course you do. I loved making it. Oh, there it is. I love going shopping. Go back to the mall. Hey guys! Hi. My purse! It's gone! It was here like a minute ago, I swear! Must have swiped it right as you guys were walking over! 
Uh-uh. No way someone steals from Roxy and gets away with it. Let's investigate. I like how they're all friends. Like, I haven't met one person that they're enemies with yet. They're just every- they're besties with everyone. Can't relate. <laughs> is the doggo the thief? The doggo is the thief, isn't it? Hmm. All the clues point here, but... Look! It's the dog! She must have grabbed the purse. Ma Vera? You took someone's purse? Drop it. I guess it kind of looks like her fluffy dog toy from home. Sorry for the mix-up. I'll make sure to get the purse back to your friend as uh, soon as I've de-slobbered it. You know, slobber or no slobber, Vera clearly knows a sweet airport look when she sees one. Isn't that right, little fashionista? How about a picture, Vera? Oh my. Phew, girls, we did it. I put everything I had into these designs. We've got rockin' new ideas, the cutest accessories, and off-the-hook creativity. These outfits are gonna look hot on the red carpet. Fashion show, here we come. Let's go! Okay, this is it. The outfit should be here. Uh, Angel, this place is empty. Found it, it's right there. Wait, what's that? There it is! A Scorchin secret designer ensemble, hidden in plain sight. Scorchin. It's gorgeous. Guys, let's head back to the apartment stat. I've got a serious case of try it on itis. Oh, I have no <laughs> clue. That outfit does look cool. Like how they're all doing the same pose. They're just like, <laughs> Change of plan, boys. We're doing the concert. Huh? What happened to Aton? Aton? I, uh, kind of not a rock guitarist. <laughs> He'll explain later. What's this band called again? Uh, Noise. Then get ready to make some. I guess we're doing this. There's no music! There's no music! There's no I can't believe we didn't recognize the Brass Rock Angels. You guys are awesome. We try. Ooh, how about a Brass Rock Angels and Noise selfie? I bet we'd break the internet. Everyone say, guitar solo. Yes, can I offer you something to drink? Offer you a drink? Ooh, you're good. But we see right through you. I'm sorry. I don't know what you're talking about. Mm -hmm. You can drop the act. We know you're the secret designer. Impressive. What gave me away? Your red suede shoes. You don't leave the house without them. How do people know that if they don't know him? Clever. Well, you found me. I suppose that earns you a secret designer inside scoop. You do want to know my design secrets, right? Of course. I had a good teacher and a true passion for fashion. Nah. Love that. How come you use a secret identity? Mystery is exciting, isn't it? Isn't it? Why did you decide to come tonight? I heard a certain group of dazzling new designers would be here. The truth is, I came to see you. I'm important. Not so secret, secret designer anymore. We're taking a selfie and posting it on the internet. It's Didn't time. He... Get ready, designers. The show is about to. Uh oh, crisis. What's this? The power is out. Uh, I can't see my hand in front of my face. How are the models supposed to walk a runway like this? I know they say black goes with everything. But this is taking it a little far. Mr. Beretti, any ideas? I, uh, uh, sorry girls, if you'll just excuse me, uh, what have you done this time, old friend? We got this. Angel, hand me that flashlight. Let's find the fuse box and get these lights back on. Find the fuse box. Oh, there it is. <laughs> that was easy.
I could, I could pull that off. Fuck. I can't do this. I can't do this. That was horrible. You did great at the runway. <laughs> You're such a liar. <laughs> You're such a liar. That was amazing. <laughs> uh, I think they liked it. No, 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 girls. No one liked it. They loved it. Uh, congratulations. That's such a lie. Aw, thanks, Mr. Beretti. We couldn't have done it without you. Nonsense. Uh, the talent is all yours. <sighs> Come here, guys. I'm calling a group hug. At least they're doing different poses this time. I have to say, I'm impressed. I failed the entire thing. Why are you lying to me? Sorry about the surprise. <clears throat> Power outage before the show. I needed to create a distraction while I spoke privately with my old tutor, Beretti. Oh, Beretti is your teacher. He agreed with me entirely. I think you've earned this. Don't open it until you're back at your apartment. See you around. Come on, come on! Open the envelope! We have to see what the secret designer gave us! I'm betting it's tickets to New York. No way! What is it? These are four invitations to the style and soiree! What? Let me see. Shine bright, fashion queens. Get ready to sparkle and shimmer at this year's blingiest bash, the New York style and soiree! I told you! You've gotta be messing. The style and soiree? That's the most insanely exclusive fashion event of the year! Grab your cutest sneakers, girls, because we've gotta run to the airport! The brats are flying to New York! Let's fucking go! Uh, let's fly to New York! Okay, the last one we haven't played as is Chloe. <laughs> and I know none of you like her! I think we need to play them all. It's your turn to shine. Good evening, and welcome to the Style and Soiree. Tonight, we make history. Bring your passion and your best fashion. Enjoy a magical midnight mixer for the world's most styling stars. This is so exciting. No joke, I've been photographed like a gazillion times already. Yeah, thanks again for the tick, secret designer. This party is wild. You okay? You seem a little stressed. Me? Stressed? No, no, no. Uh, how did you know? Truthfully, prep for the soiree has been a nightmare. All right. Guests are arriving and nothing's quite finished. <laughs> a perfect night ruined before it can even begin. Um, hold up. We've still got time. Whatever you need, we're on it. I invited a DJ to play before the main show, but they're stuck in traffic. So we gotta play? What we really need is some music. Music? That's like Bunny Boo's whole deal. She's always got poppin' playlists on her phone. Sasha, you can hook us up with some slammin' tunes, right? Slammin' tunes. Way ahead of you, girl. What vibe are we going for? Pop? Pop? Pop, I mean. Let's rock and pop. Gotta be hip-hop. Aw, oh, shit. Perfect. Music anyway. This event is about to get bumpin'. Bumpin'? Plink. Oh, a text. Hmm. Sounds like things aren't going too well over on the stage. Did he just say plink? Plink. He just said plink. Oh, I got a text. He, uh, what year was this released? Uh, two weeks ago. <laughs> it honestly looks like a game from 2006 or something. It does, but it literally got released two weeks ago. Where is the stage organized? Ah, oh, there they are. There we go. Okay, I found it. Just took a while. On the down low, we heard you guys need some help. You got that right. I've been trying to set up the stage lighting for like an hour, but I just can't choose. What color do you like best? White, yellow, pink. None. Great thinking. Give me a sec. Hmm. I don't know if I like that. Ooh, fancy and funky. I like it. You know, it does look good. Thanks. By the way, you seen my assistant? She's meant to be styling the tables, but she's sort of gone MIA. Could you help me find her? She's got to be around here somewhere. Sure. Hey, girl. No stress, but I think your boss is looking for you. 
She said something about decorating tables. Oh, hi. Yeah. Oh, no. You look freaked. Let me guess. The decorators missed their flight. The key table ornament got stolen by a cute dog. Or, or... No, no, nothing like that. I'm supposed to style all these tables for tonight, but I can't decide what theme to go for. Oh, God. The styling soiree is such a big deal. All the influencers post pictures and stuff. I'm feeling super overwhelmed. Maybe? This is a very purple party. Yeah, oh no. The glitter and sun are the two most annoying particles, I Whoa, swear. That exactly. looks great. Thanks for the help. As I was vacationing in the land of Overthinkia on that one. Vacationing in the land of Overthinkia? Really? Really, game? Oh, I hate this. <laughs> this hurts. Oh, I totally forgot. Marco Beretti's looking for you. You should probably go find him. Hello. Ah, my favorite fledgling designers. Wonderful to see you. Mr. Beretti, how's it going? I, uh, could actually use your help with something. Of course. I seem to have misplaced my suitcase, and it had something important inside. Suitcase, huh? Can you help me find it? On it. Girls, it's go time. We got a suitcase to find. Something important, huh? What do you think he has in there? Wrong answers only. His dog, he left his dog in the suitcase. Yes, perfect. Missing suitcase delivery! Oh, perfecto. Thank you, Chloe. Now, why don't we take a peek inside? There! What do you think? Four designer dresses just for you. For the brats. I could give nothing less than perfection. So each gown was hand sewn by your proudest mentor, me. I'm so cool. Look at this skin. You've gotta be kidding, Mr. B. <laughs> These are for us? They're scorching. Oh, Mr. Beretti, thank you. We have to get you like a fruit basket or something. A fruit basket? Yes, that is so not styling. Let's see these stylish dresses. Okay, you know what? These are kind of cute. They're not bad. The poses are bad though. Well, if it isn't the Bratz Rock Angels, looking good, ladies. I'd love to chat, but I'm kind of in the middle of a musical emergency. Of course you are. We're on in a couple minutes, but I can't find my bandmates. Well, of course you can't. The noise boys are the best, but sometimes I swear it's like herding cats. Could you help me round them up? How can you lose your fucking boy band members? I have questions, concerns, and everything above. Okay, there's one. That is two. Oh, he's right there. I'm dumb. I'm stupid. All right, noise is back together and ready to rock. Wait, why is my lead singer miming at me like that? No time for charades, man. Oh no, he doesn't have a voice. You're uh, one syllable, a dog. No, a cat, uh, a horse, you're a horse. You're a horse. Oh no, I get it. Your horse. Your voice is gone. Talk about bad timing, bro. If our front man can't sing, there's no way we can do the gig. Ladies, do you think you could fill in for us? We have done everything else in this party so far, so sure. <laughs> no problem. We've got your back. Totally. I know some scorching dance moves we could do. Major thanks. Have a blast up there. You're gonna tear the roof off this place. All right, we're doing this again. With no music. Let's go. Brass, whatever. Ooh. Hey, look at them go. This is beautiful. I love this. This is amazing. This is beautiful. Gorgeous. Everything above. Whoops! I'm not good at buttons. I think I am because I'm a gamer, but I'm not. I did it though. I did it. Am I brats now? Nice poses, girls. Did I finish it? Is the game done? I finished it!
I did it! It's over! I'm free! Let's go! The credits have more music than the game! Yep. You did a scorching job, Bunny Foo. I hate that. Now speedrun the game? <laughs> Never. <laughs> well, thank you to everyone who was watching. And if you're watching on YouTube, please subscribe. I would appreciate it. But yeah, I hope you like this torture. I'm done. I'm not playing this game anymore. <laughs>